racing was always my dream, and you know I was lucky enough to to make it to the top level and and perform well. And when things didn't really go the way I had planned, um, I was trying to find something I wanted to do. I didn't know if it was soccer or what it was, but you know I was just playing a little family football and decided to kick some field goals with my brother. And you know he thought I should send some film into Coach Hill and, and try and play football and make that kind of my new dream. And so, you know, when New Year's came around, I kind of made it my goal to play football. And I didn't know how it would happen, but I was lucky enough to be, you know, brought in here over the summer and, and proved to the coaches I was a hard worker. And then they gave me an opportunity this spring to kick. And, you know, but there were still the unanswered questions of whether or not I could kick in a game under pressure. And Onside kick, Phillips has recovered. It's Utah football. Wow. Andy Phillips with the onside kick is recovered at his own 48-yard line. That first game was was critical for me and um, and for the team just to, to prove to and to the fans to prove that you know under that pressure I can I can uh, make the field goals. Hold is down. The kick is high. It's away and it is good. I've never received this much attention. It's also new and, and it's awesome, but at the same time I've got to keep my head because it's just one game. You know, and, and it's one and zero. But um, in order to, to be great, you have to be consistent. So that's kind of my focus. Is and I think I an hopefully answered some questions that game, and will answer some questions throughout the season.